Hello friends and welcome back to my channel. I am your friend Ashfaq and today we will see how to upgrade the ESXi 7 host to the ESXi 8 using command line through the offline bundle. So I have logged into my ESXi 7 host. This is the host name of my ESXi 7 host and this is the version of the host and this host is having the IP address 192.168.0.140 Today we will be upgrading this host to the ESXi 8.0 Before you proceed for the upgrade you must visit these two pages of the VMware the first one is ESXi 8 hardware requirement and second one is VMware compatibility guide. I have already logged into the customer connect portal of the VMware.com and uh, on my home page you can see uh, my evaluation is showing because I have registered for the vSphere 8 evaluation. You can refer to this video on how to register for the vSphere 8 evaluation. The link of this video I will provide you in the description. So I will click on download. And we have to download this file VMware vSphere Hypervisor Offline Bundle I will click on manually download ok so download completed uh, and this is the offline bundle which we have just downloaded now I have to upload this offline bundle to the local data store of my SSI 7 host. So on the host I will go to storage, I will go to data store, I will browse the data store and I will click on upload and I will locate the downloaded file. Ok so file upload completed. I will close this window. Uh, for this met method, uh, there are two prerequisites. The first one is we have to enable the SSH for this host. I will go to manage, I will go to services and I will select the SSH and you can see here this service is stopped. I will go to action and I will start this service. Ok now SSH for this host is running and for the second prerequisite I will go to system swap and I will go to edit setting and you can see here in front of the data store none is showing in the drop down I will select my data store and I will click on save I will now go ahead and enter my host into the maintenance mode yes Okay, so my ESXi 7 host has been entered into the maintenance mode. Now I will start making the command for the upgrade. ESXCLI software 
profile update hyphen d and i will go to my host data store and i will copy the location of my host data store slash i will go to downloaded offline bundle and i will copy the complete name of the downloaded file and i will paste it here space hyphen p space now we have to enter here the image profile name for the ssi 8 for that i will go to this link and these are the image profiles for the ssi 8 you can search on google vsphere ssi 8 image profiles and you will get the image profile name so i want to upgrade to this profile so i will copy this profile name and i will paste it here in the command okay so this is my complete command i will now open the putty and i will log in to my exercise 7 host Okay, now uh, on the putty, I will give this command which we have just prepared and I will hit enter. So you can see here update completed. and message is coming that reboot required i will go to host so you can see here on the host message is coming that reboot is required i will go to actions and i will click on reboot If I go to console of the ESXi host, you can see here it is rebooting. Okay, so here reboot completed. I will again go back to browser and I will give the IP address of my SXI host username root I will provide the password for the root I will exit the maintenance mode and now you can see my host has been upgraded to ESXi 8 and this is the version and this is the image profile of my ESXi host and you can see here the host name and the IP address is same by this way you can easily upgrade your ESXi 7 host to the ESXi 8 using the offline bundle through the putty all the links used in this video I will provide you in the description. I will provide you the command also which I have used for the 
upgrade of my host you will have to prepare your command accordingly as per the your downloaded file name and your desired image profile name hope you find this video helpful subscribe the channel to encourage my work like the video share it with the friends and spread the knowledge i will see you in the next video bye for now